guys, it's Ariana. Welcome back to my channel. So for tonight's video, we are doing another review on a heated blanket. So I actually think I like this blanket more than my Sunbeam blanket, and I've been using Sunbeam blankets for quite a long time now. So I've gotten heated blankets probably about once a year for the last like four or five years, and I really enjoyed heated blankets from Sunbeam, the brand Sunbeam, but I think I found a brand that makes even better blankets. So this is the heated throw from the brand Brookstone. So this is what the box looks like. So it does come with a remote. It comes with four heat settings, ultra soft, safe, four hour auto off. And I do believe it has a warranty of five years. So that's pretty great. It's very similar to Sunbeam. Sunbeam has a five year warranty as well, but I have been trying for the last like six months to get my blanket warranty from Sunbeam and it's just been like an ongoing email chain and nothing's happened. They asked me for photos, so I sent them photos and I haven't heard back and like sending emails and asking them what's going on and they keep just like asking me questions and then nothing's ever done about it. So I don't know what's going on about those blankets, but my blankets from Sunbeam only last about a year. It's disappointing and they're supposed to work for, well, they have a five year warranty, so they should last more than one year and they never do. So that's why I picked up a different blanket from a different brand. I got this one at Costco. I believe it was only like $50. It was very inexpensive and it looks like this. So this is what my heated blanket looks like. It is really, really cute. It's really, really fuzzy. It's very soft like it says on the box. <laughs> it's very, very, very comfortable. And the one thing that I'm absolutely obsessed with with this blanket is the remote control is actually attached to it. So you don't have a really bulky remote like you do on the Sunbeam blankets that actually have to be like clipped on and break and are a pain in the ass. This one actually is already sewn into to the blanket, you can't lose it, and it's just right there. And you can just turn it on and turn it off. So here is it on, it has four settings, so it's on the lowest setting right now, and then you just click it, it goes to the second one, then the third one, then the fourth one. The one thing that I really enjoy about this blanket is it gets so fucking hot. So my Sunbeam blankets, I do believe I mentioned in my last video that I wish there was like a higher setting so that the blanket did get a little bit warmer, just because it gets warm that it's like cozy, but it doesn't get hot. This blanket gets hot. It is so freaking lovely. So because I've been working from home all freaking year, <laughs> I have just been sitting in my office on my normal office chair and I came up with the idea about, I don't know, two months ago that I wanted a heated office chair and I've just been laying my blanket down on my chair, just right across it and turning it on and all fucking day I have a heated freaking ass warmer and I love it. So it does get so warm that I do have to turn it off because I feel like my ass is going to burn off, but it is super comfortable. It's a really, really soft material. It gets super warm. It's super comfortable. It's super cozy. The only thing that I would say that I don't really care for with this blanket is when the blanket is getting warm, like the coils are warming up inside it. It does kind of have an odd smell, so keep that in mind. Um, I don't know if it's just my blanket or what, but it smells odd. Sometimes I just kind of turn it off and come back a couple hours later and turn it on and then it doesn't really smell anymore. So keep that in mind. I don't know what it is, but it does kind of have like a weird odor. <laughs> But other than that, this blanket works really great. So these blankets are obviously plugged into the wall. So here is the cord. The cord is attached to the blanket and it just plugs into the wall like normal. I have it laying across me right now and it's turned on and it's really, really comfortable and it's really, really warm. It's a fairly big blanket. So this is a 50 by 60 inch blanket or 127 meters by 152 centimeters. So it is a really big blanket. It is a heated throw. So obviously it's not like a huge, huge, huge blanket like a quilt, but it is a throw and it does cover me completely. And I like to use it in my office just when I'm working, so that's where I keep my blanket most of the time, but it does fit across my love seat really, really nicely as well. So if I'm watching movies, I can just curl up on top of it or underneath it. I like to lay across these blankets or sit on them just because that's how I find you get like the most warmness out of them. Honestly, I'm obsessed with it. I prefer this blanket honestly over my sunbeam blanket. So my snowflake blanket that I did my last video on is a really, really nice blanket, but it doesn't get as warm as I would like it to. So I prefer this one. Honestly, I just picked this one up just because I was curious what this blanket would be like. I saw it at Costco, I think about three months ago and I was like, oh, sunbeam's not in Costco anymore for some reason. My Costco didn't sell any sunbeam blankets this year and I saw these Brookstone ones and I was like, okay, well, let's give it a try. I just decided that it was a good idea and I picked it up and I'm super happy that I did. I think it's really cute. It's a really adorable Horrible blanket. It's really, really, really soft and it gets so fucking warm. I'm not kidding. It sometimes feels like my ass is like on fire because it gets that warm. I really like the fact that it has four heat settings. Like I said, with the Sunbeam blanket, it only has three heat settings and I wish it had one more. This one actually has one more and I love the fact 
that it comes already attached to the blanket, sewn into the blanket. So if you don't know anything about Brookstone or you've never seen these blankets before, I highly recommend going on Amazon and purchasing one if you're in the market for a heated blanket because honestly, you can't go wrong with this blanket. This blanket's amazing and I'm obsessed with it. So a few cons with it though, there is a few things. So you can wash these blankets as normal. You can just throw it into the washer and dryer and then plug it back in when you're done. Make sure you obviously unplug it. But the thing that I've noticed a little bit with these blankets is after you've unplugged it and you're plugging it back in, you may need to plug it in again. You need to actually unplug it out of the wall and unplug it from the blanket and then replug everything back in to get it to work. So I've noticed that I've tried plugging in my blanket and waiting about 10 minutes and it didn't get warm at all and I was like oh no did I break my blanket and then I just unplugged everything replugged everything back in and it got warm like instantly so far I haven't really had any issues other than that it's just kind of temperamental sometimes and it works after like a minute of me just playing around with it so it plugs into the blanket like this and it just unplugs really easy but one of my prongs on here did break in the washing machine so keep that in mind these blankets can break pretty easily I think so my blanket still works it's just the one prong that broke but everything else still works fine it's just like the piece that clips in on the side. It's not the actual plug that goes into the blanket that broke or else it probably wouldn't work. It's just like a plastic piece that had like two plastic prongs that like slid in. One of them broke. So keep that in mind if you're going to wash these blankets. Maybe try washing it on like a delicate cycle instead of just throwing it into your washer like I did. It does have a five year warranty. It is a really nice blanket and honestly it was very inexpensive. Like I said, I'll post the full price on the screen. I think I only paid like 50 or $60. It was very inexpensive considering I think I paid 80 for my Amazon one from Sunbeam. So I I'm really excited that I got this blanket. I think this blanket is absolutely amazing. It works really, really well and I highly recommend them. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know this video was kind of random, but I did just want to come on here and kind of rant and rave about this blanket because I am obsessed with it. And now I'm gonna go sit in my office, play some video games and be cozy with my warm blanket. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below for more content like this. If you guys did enjoy this video, please leave me a comment down below. Have a conversation with me. I love responding to you guys. Help me boost my engagement because the more you guys like and comment on my videos, the more YouTube will boost my video into the platform so you guys can actually see it and we can get more people watching my videos. So please make sure to like this video. Please make sure to leave a comment down below. Any engagement is amazing and it will help me grow my channel. But thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you guys at the next one. Bye!